Um, wait, 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 where, where is it? So you sent it over, so let's get to it. Yes, we're doing the two tall boys awards. Yes, uh, this is kind of replacing the wrap up that we did last year, kind of. Um, um, you sent it to me. It's on Instagram. It don't matter. Oh, okay. It's on it. our it's on our IG. Got it. All right, yep. cool. So we we uh, mentioned it last week that we mm-hmm. were doing this. So we also posted about it um, about the TTB awards. Yeah. So uh, we have four categories here. Oh, yeah. Um, want to do the favorite album and stuff first before we get into that? This week, oh yeah, this is favorite album. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of our personal picks anyway. Okay, cool. Uh, favorite album this year? I think we both kind of agree. It's Mada. Favorite album is made of? Yeah. Um, uh, we could do favorite hip hop albums, though, as a aside. Yeah. Do you, do we count? I I know. I'm, you can. Okay. Do we count Pink Friday 2 as a hip hop album? Technically, it's 2023. But no, I didn't. I don't know if we count as a hip hop album or a pop album. I don't know if we count as it's kind of, uh, it's more poppy than that. I think it's, well, what are we counting Doja Cat's album? Scarlet? Mm-hmm. That was a rap album, though. And Pink Friday, Pink Friday 2 as well. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'll say, Pink Party too. Got it. Yeah, yeah. Um, my favorite album is Made, of course, and then Pink Party. Right. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Um, so it's probably Scarlet, but I do want to give a quick shout out to I forgot what the album actually called, but Larry June had an album with Cardo, the mm-hmm. producer. Mm-hmm. Really good album. Really good album. Really, really amazing good album. album. Actually, love that album. Yeah. Actually. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, but Scarlet probably. Yeah, Scarlet. Yeah. Um and Killer Mike also shout out to Killer Mike. Yeah, Killer Mike's great yeah, album. Great yeah, album as well. For sure. Um for sure. Objectively. Objectively. Probably really probably the best album. Yeah, yeah. Uh so next was favorite show or movie, like of like this year, right? Mm-hmm. Oh. Um what show I know there's a bunch of shows I've watched. What show ended and I was like, fuck, I can't wait for it to come back. Um See, that's crazy. I should I should have thought about this more. Wait, what about you go first? So if we're doing like it so to me when I say show movies like the best thing you saw on the screen. So it could be show, movie, anime, whatever. Yeah. Um I'm gonna be honest, bro. It was it was it was tough because the Mario movie was fire. Yeah, the series from Ninja Turtle movie was fire. Yeah. Um What TV show did we end up watching this year? I feel like we watched something. I don't remember. But I'm gonna tell you right now. Yeah. For my anime people, Jujutsu Kaisen season two has been going crazy. Dog. Yeah. It's been going nuts. I like Jujutsu Kaisen because like it's it's kind of you can get attached to characters, but I wouldn't do it. Uh huh. Because like when people like you know how in Dragon Ball Z like you get killed like oh we need to bring you back or whatever mm. nah. A lot, a lot of people like if they're gone, they, 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 they they're, gone. their bodies are exploding. So, oh, yeah, 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 no, they're, they're not, they're not coming back. back. Like, that's it for them, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So, like, that's mm-hmm. I like that because, like, it, they don't they take people away quick, yeah. So, I kind of like that. It's been going up, and yeah. I'm still watching it. So, I'll probably say Jujutsu Kaisen in season two has been fire. Gotcha. I'm gonna say, I thought I figured it out. Um, it's gonna be uh, a I can't do ties. You say we can't do that. I hate not doing being with ties. Well, I'm gonna say succession. Okay. Um Oh yeah, that's, that wrapped that up. That was just year, right? yeah, yeah, succession. That final season that was, was early in the year too. Yeah. Yeah. That final season was literally like every episode I just like I everyone's like we all texting about it, like holding our breath, like, yo, yo, what the fuck? Like, type stuff. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So I would say succession. Also because like it ended which sucked. Um I hated I hated no, the ending was great, but I hated its ending. Mm-hmm. Like because they leave you on such a cliffhanger. Like, there's so much more that can happen. Right, that they could do, yeah. Yeah, but it was a good announcement at the end of the day. So I'm going to say Succession, maybe Your Honor. But Succession. Okay, yeah. yeah. Your Honor was good. Yeah, fact. But I'm going to say Succession. Okay. Yeah. Uh, favorite game? Uh, Final Fantasy 16. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to say only, I don't like it now because it's just more open world, but I'm going to say Hogwarts. Okay. Um, Hogwarts is my favorite game this year. You you know how excited I was about that. Yeah, you were very excited top of the year. Yeah, yeah. yeah so sure. Hogwarts, great story mode, great open world. It's actually the source of our most listened to episode, actually. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, oh that's interesting. Um, it's not for the reasons. It's not. Oh. <laughs> oh yeah 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 yeah. yeah. I mean, it was to be fair, it was hilarious. Yeah. Uh, it was it was absolutely hilarious. <laughs> but but yeah no it yeah. Yeah, yeah. I want to say it was definitely Hogwarts. I, 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 I can I, see people liking that game. 
I actually like, went. I actually went back and played it a few days ago. Yeah, like the open world portion. Of it. Right, just going around doing, doing missions. Stuff. Yeah, which I mean, listen, as a game is as a gameplay thing, it's probably great. It's just like it's the person that's hot that sucks. Yeah, first time. Yeah, it the person that's hot it just sucks. It sucks, but the actual game, the concept of the game, is dope. Yeah. Like being making yourself right. into someone that went to Harvard, like testing into your house and like all that stuff that you right that you dream, dream about, about as a kid and reading the books like it's just it yeah like I say just like that it's not a, a shitty person yeah yeah billionaire but a shitty person 100 now um, we can get to the awards let's get it okay all right so we'll start with the first awards yeah. so uh for the tcb awards um again we've explained that we want to do this pretty dope mm-hmm. um so the first category is the you uh i kind of want to end with that one Actually, okay, we're starting. We're, we're starting. We're starting. Okay, that's fine. The you can't come with us award. Yeah, which basically means that mm-hmm. in twenty twenty three you have been so annoying that we would prefer if you just stayed here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we'll go with the nominees. The nominees are Blueface and Krishan slash that baby, mm-hmm. the Smith family, mm-hmm. Kanye West, mm-hmm. Tory Lanez, mm-hmm. Tiffany Haddish. Mm-hmm. And Mariah Mills. Yeah. Now, those are the nominees. We, before we, you know, decide if one of them is the winner, did you want to bring anyone else into the fold? Um, I thought I, I feel like I have, I have been one of the biggest ones before. I, think, I thought that too. I was like, there's somebody, somebody did something stupid in the past seven days. Where I was like, oh my god, I'm about to add them to the list. I was definitely there. Was definitely. Someone that last week I was like, mm. oh, I was almost gonna put John on here. Oh, yeah. that dunk and then he did that thing at the end of the game. I was like, no, you have to learn the lesson. Cause like, just stop. even if that's not what you were doing, it's like it looks like it, and yeah. you really can't be doing any of that. But I get it. It's whatever. It's whatever. I'm like, I'm letting him pass. Um, Plus, I like it watching play basketball. Yeah, yeah, he's been doing well. Uh, I'm, I feel like there was definitely someone last week, and I'm gonna as I'm driving away, I'm gonna remember who it was. Probably. Yeah, it's gonna piss me off. Um. But I'm gonna say, yeah, I don't, I don't remember who it was. But okay. Who, who, so I know who my who my award goes to in this. Is a close. It was a close. To, actually, maybe I don't know. Okay, let's try to eliminate who we can. Who isn't gonna win the award? All right, I can say who is gonna win the award. Right. Uh, the person that's not gonna win the award is Mariah Meadows because I haven't heard from her in a little bit. Now, to be fair, she did just post something that she was like, ooh, you should, because when they were talking about how Zion was out of shape, she posted, was like, yeah, you're out of shape. That's how you can last long in bed. And we're like, oh, uh, Shawty, we saw your messages and your desperation. You don't get to play those cards. And anymore. I think that's why I'm just like, whatever. It's she's, like, you don't get to play those cards anymore. She's lost easy, that battle. She's easily ignorable. Yeah, very so, much so. So I'm going to say she, she's not also, award. She's also one of her scenes. It's not that great. Yeah, so, exactly. So she's whatever. Um, Tiff, my, the next one was Tiffany Haddish. Yeah, only I, because there's other ones on this list. Yeah, and mm-hmm. hers is uh, she's just annoying. Yeah, and, and it's more like kind of sad. She clearly has problems. She has problems. She has DUI. Right. So yeah, yeah she clearly has problems. So yeah. I'm let I'm letting it slide. Um, next for me is Tory Lanez. Yeah. Well, we won't see him for a while anyway. So. Yeah. So yeah, he yeah really can't. Yeah. Us. Um, I would like to see more May. You see her recently? Yeah, that that video was like. <laughs> Hey, that video was alright. Oh. She had to do, but like that, that video was alright. Yeah. Pause. <laughs> Are you recording? Come on, man. Uh, what's the next? What's all the, right. What's, uh, the next, what's the next thing? Man? So that was these three. Is down for me. Is down these three for both of us. So we had the Smith family, Kanye West, and Blue Blueface, Kershawn, that baby. Yeah. Okay. I. Okay, I know who I'm, who I's not gonna get the award, which is crazy. Okay. But if you guys not getting an award, because now I feel like the book tour is over with, we're kind of cool. The Smith family. But it's hard. That's why they were in top three. But it's hard. But I'm going to move them because I think the book tour is, is away. So Right. I, but see, here's the problem is that mm-hmm. right after it failed, because it failed. Yeah. Right after it failed, she's like, the slap say me and Chris, is, me and Will's marriage. I'm like, then why, why did we talk about it as if it was like the worst thing possible? Yeah. That's what pissed me off, bro. Yeah. And yeah. then like, he, like, it's just annoying. It's just this constant thing. This is, this is, like, a, this is a strong category. Bro, I'm just saying, bro. I, I, 
That's it's, fine. We can we can agree not to bring them in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the kids. The kids are inoffensive. And I think and I think that's why it's we're just giving the them parents, here. bro. It's yeah. the parents are so annoying. Um. Okay. So, it's down to Blueface, Chris Sean, and Kanye West. It's, okay. This is tough. This is tough because I would I, rather be. Blue. I hate being a hypocrite. Right. I hate it. Oh, I no. hate. Oh, it. oh no. What's happening? The only reason that I say it should not go to Kanye West, okay, is because he provides some form of value. Okay. 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 I, you know what I'm saying? I think I'm picking he, up what you've been doing. I think he is borderline a horrible person. Yeah. He does have issues. I, I'm not going to doubt that. He does have issues. Mm-hmm. And some of the things he says are just like, bro, you're not learning. Yeah. Like, it's like you keep refreshing back to the old version. Uh huh. And you, you need to update your, the iOS. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> update, update the Android system. You have to do yeah. something. It's not working. Yeah. But because he provides some form of value, mm-hmm. I don't want to give him a board. Because those other three people provide zero value. <laughs> not the baby. Nothing. Not providing no value. Nothing. He's, the baby's contributing to the problem. Because if that baby, if something happens to that baby, I have to hear about those two again. You're right. I'm tired. The baby didn't ask to be here, though. But you, I agree with you, though. <laughs> that baby is the youngest award recipient ever. Because that's I, that's who it's going to. I'm I'm going blue face Chris Sean. And I keep baby. having to mute their their word their names. Yeah. Because I keep for, like when it pops up like yo, why is it oh the mute wore off? Let me go ahead and mute them again. The it's mute yeah, the mute wore off. It's ridiculous. I hate yeah. I hate them, bro. I'd rather leave them here. They can stay. In 2023, because yeah. you, you can't come with us. You, I, I'm over them as a unit, um, as a conglomerate, as anything. Mm-hmm. All right, so the winner. So we had the winner. The winner of UK Come with Us War is yeah. Blueface, Chris Sean, and that baby, and that baby. <laughs> All right, for the next nomination, we have uh, for the CTV Awards, we have the Came Up Short Award. Mm. Um, that's the award. For Actually, let's 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 do let's do the moment of the year award and then that the one's meme of the year. Uh, meme of the year, yeah. Yeah. The meme of the year award we're gonna do first. Yeah. Because then we could gotta do LVP and yeah, that works. Yeah. Um. So that's basically just the biggest, uh, funniest event meme worthy that was event. that happened this year. Um, yeah. So yeah, go ahead. So the <laughs> the nominees are. <laughs> why am I laughing at this? This is because they're hilarious. Dissolvable capsule. Uh huh. Ocean Gate. Slamma in Alabama, Battle at the Dock. Battle at the Dock, sorry. Yep. Boys in Blue Balls. Cop Polish is Cold Glock. Uh, ja Wick, Ja Moran shooting drills. <laughs> yeah. And Not Real, which was plain shoddy, seeing you guys saw what you saw, the, the invisible person that was right. an alien or whatever. That, it, that wasn't anybody. That okay. wasn't anybody, but yeah. They clumped her. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, now, before we hop in again, is there anything that you would like to bring into the fold? Um, no. Okay. Okay. No. I think I think these are like the five. These are the pretty strong. Yeah, these five. are like the five biggest. Yeah. To me, in my yeah, opinion. I agree. Um. So. All right, so you want to go with who we're eliminating from? We can that. do that again. Okay. Uh, Plain Shawty's out to me. Huh? Plain Shawty's out. Plain Shawty's out. Uh, uh, great meme. Especially since I know that she's that she's not real anymore. Yeah. Yeah. They got they got to her. They got to her. Yeah, they got to her. She's disappeared. Yeah. Yeah, she's a whole different person. Yeah. Correct. Uh, uh, I'm gonna say I'm gonna say boys and blue balls can go. That was hilarious. That was hilarious. I'm sorry. That that, that was, was hilarious. That was hilarious. That was. Hilarious. Did you hear that she's suing uh, now? She's suing. Why is she suing? She's saying that uh, she was groomed by her, what you call it, by her people. And she's seeking, I'm going to say, either three to five million dollars. And you know she's going to get some money. So I just want everybody to be prepared for that. The judge granted her a trial, uh, granted her a case, and just be prepared that she will win money. So she's going to get this money, plus the OnlyFans money that she's continuing doing. I've never seen Caillou with hair get money like this. That's crazy. <laughs> Ah, uh, Caillou hair is wild. That's wild. Um, all right. Spit shine, then blocks. 
Jawa Kesigo. Jawa Kesigo. Jawa Kesigo. Jawa Kesigo. Funny. Funny, but it also very disappointing. It's this really came down to two, two things. The it, drama it is so tough. To and by the way, it is so close because... This is crazy, bro. Bro, I was going to say that black people, we're just unserious. All the time. We're just unserious. No matter what it is. Even when we're supposed to be serious, we're unserious. It doesn't matter, dog. I'm sorry. It's just... It's just, we were so used to taking trauma and just turning into something else. It's just, it's just a second instinct now. Rapid release pill. Like, I saw a bunch. Like, Bro, we were going crazy. We, we were going crazy. Crazy. I had my winner, though. I had mine, too. Mine is the Alabama. See, I had Ocean Gate, bro. Yeah, my, I think mine the, is the, the, the Calling that the SS Alpha Salsa was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm sorry. The SS Alka-Seltzer is crazy. That is bro. crazy. That is crazy. I, 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 the reason why I'm going slam it in Alabama is because there was no seriousness about it. Like, there was no, it didn't get like, oh, you guys got to be serious to take this serious. There was none of that. It was straight. Everyone funny, really was just like. Funny memes. Everyone straight. was just like from the jump. People that were enemies were were now like they were adding wrestling things. They were adding Jr. commentary. The shit, like they the, were doing everything. The possible. chair in the head, bro. He got acquitted. Like I mean, bro, it, that jump was crazy. dog. The bat signal, Aquaman. Aquaman. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, yeah. It's dead heat close. Like dead photo heat finish. Close. Slam Alabama is probably the choice here. For yeah, sure. that, like that he close like that. That was a that was a crazy day on the internet. That was a it was a crazy like two or three days. Especially that was a, that was a crazy because the footage kept coming out. Too. The footage, the more footage, footage kept coming kept out from more, different angles. Yeah, yes, yeah. when more people jumped off the boat and now they have a crowd of people. Yeah. <laughs> and they played the yeah <laughs> they that, played yeah, the Avengers that, music. Yeah, that was yeah that's a fact. And they say he threw a hat, but they was like yo that was like the that, that was, was Bobby Smurda hat. And that then, was the Bobby Smurda version. And to cap it all off, that was the port that slaves were yep. taken to. Yep. So that was all that. Take cake. all that into account. Yeah. 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 It was like it was yeah. perfect. It was like I, but, at the same, came back. but at the same time, at the same time, those same oceans that they crossed over took those four people in the capsule ancestors. <laughs> this. What's the next thing? I'm sorry. <laughs> Who won the award? So, for this year's TTB award for the meme of the year, I guess we're both in agreement here. Yeah, Slamma in Alabama. And Slamma in Alabama, Battle at the Docks. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Woo, clap, yeah. clap, 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 clap. Clap for them. All right. Put your chairs down. Put your, put your chairs down. <laughs> that shit is hilarious. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did they have the training videos? <laughs> People like training for the next time if you were hitting with the chair. <laughs> with the, that shit was funny. Oh, man, what a time. The K uh the Came Up Short Award. So this is for the LVP yeah. of the year. Um what does LVP for stand? What does LVP for? Basically stand? the least valuable person yeah. of the year. Uh just, just had they had a bad year <laughs> oh, overall. Overall. So we have the choices here. The nominees are Jada Pinkett Smith, um, which was she's she is nominated due to her husband character assassination. Um, and her, un- her underwhelming memoir. We have Takashi Six Nine, mm-hmm. who was jump at the gym. Uh, we have Atlanta restaurant scene, which is getting exposed by Keith Lee. Mm-hmm. We have anyone who wore red boots. Those, those red boots. boots. Those yeah. the red boots. The, yeah, the yeah. cartoon looking ones. Uh, we <laughs> we have Diddy. No explanation needed. Yep. We have Harry and Meghan. Uh, all the hype in the world. No real impact like you yep. put on here. Yep. Mm-hmm. And then we have the MCU, which is... Uh, uh, they really couldn't find the footage this year, like you said yep. on this thing. Yep. They really couldn't. Yep. Um, really, really struggled to keep that uh, that momentum going. Yeah. That they built for years. Yeah, yeah. And and, and orig- originally, I was going to be like, they would be the one that we just take off quickly. But actually, I wanted to like, leave them there for a second. Because they, they did have... Not it was a rough year for them. It was, really it was a year. really rough year for them. Yeah, really rough year. Um, so are we going to do the same kind of pluck off? Um, or what do you think? How about this? How let's we, t- let's make our top two. Yeah, let's try to narrow down to two people. I like that. I like that. Uh, Jada Pinkett is one of them. Okay, for me, Jada Pinkett is one of them. Cool. Okay. Uh, we can, now it's really by picking the other person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jada Pinkett is one of them and Diddy's other one for me. Okay. Now, <laughs> that's fine. I'm, okay. I'm cool with both of those options. Okay. Okay, so I 
here's my here's my case for Jada Pinkett Smith over okay. Diddy. Okay. The reason I'm not gonna go Diddy is because TD I, Jakes. The girl been swallowed. <laughs> Swallowed him. Swallowed him. Allegedly. Allegedly. Well, you know, he said that. I know. He, he actually did say that. Part. That's, that's quotable. Cool. Um, no. So the reason I'm going uh, uh, Jada over Diddy is because I think Diddy's LVP year is really next year. I think okay. we're really, really going to see the, that, the shit. that his ramifications, allegedly, will yeah. be that will be 2024. Mm-hmm. Plus, not right. It's not right, but he did have a good album this year. So again, he provided. He did, he did. He did. You're right. You're right. He did versus Jada Pinkett Smith, who was on a mission to destroy her husband's character mm-hmm. for whatever reason, and that reason turned out to be a memoir that nobody cared about. Yeah. After she did her run, everybody just stopped talking about it. So it didn't do what it was supposed to do. So for me. That's actually, why I, I had Jada. I'm gonna. I agree with that. Actually, now that you when you brought up Diddy's album, it was pretty good. Which again doesn't make that, it right. It doesn't make it right. But it's I do want to make clear, like it's he, the he's, ex, still, he's still a shit person. I'll let you. 100. But yeah. it's it's the X factor of it, right? right. Yeah. Um, the X factor piece is is that. So I'll agree with you. I'm going to say this year's TTV award for the came up short or the LVP mm-hmm. is Jada Pinkett Smith. Yes. I want to go with that one. Yes. All right, the Larger Than Life Award. Um, the biggest award of the night. Yeah. Um, this biggest is our MVP. Award. Yeah. Uh, so we have Margot Robbie for uh the Barbie movie. We have Taylor Swift with the Billion Dollar Tour. We have Gunna, a recurring charting single, and the face of being a rat. Uh, we have Ice Spice, uh, defeating the one hit wonder label. We have SZA, uh, with her album, and we have Keith Lee, uh, with the Amass Use following. Um, my top two okay. are Keith Lee and my top two are Keith Lee and G- Gunna. This is tough. Okay. This is tough. So here's the thing. Here, right? here, it's tough. Here's the thing. I yeah. know, I know we don't listen to our music. I, I know we don't. Oh, you can tell us what's I know we don't really, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. We don't really... That's not our scene. Yeah. A billion dollars mm-hmm. off a tour is crazy. Yeah. Like, she's been in the news the entire time. It's, I just, I find it hard to not at least have her in the, we'll say top three. We'll have three, we'll top, three. top three. I just feel like it, you can't keep her out. Even if we don't yeah. choose her, I just yeah. feel like it's hard to keep her out. Yeah. I, it, okay. Okay, because you're going to make me turn to a hater, so I'm not I'm trying not to do that. I don't think you're a hater. I just don't think you like Taylor Swift, and that's fine. No, no, no I don't, don't. You don't dislike Taylor Swift, but you also don't like Taylor Swift. Yeah, I'm, oh, there, there we go. I'm indifferent about Taylor Swift. Correct. And, it was, when I, and when I'm indifferent, I sometimes like to go be like, I get, I get credit where credit is due. A billion dollars on the tour is fucking wild. It's nuts. It's nuts. It's nuts. Okay. That's where it ends. Yeah. That's I mean, it's I was, we're not going to a show. Like it's just it's that's never gonna happen. We're not going to a show. We're never going to a show. But I can respect. I can respect the hustle. Yeah, I can respect the hustle. I can respect the grind. I can respect the show. I can respect all that. I just it's just not for me. Yeah, but numbers don't lie. Numbers Jay-Z don't lie. told me that. Yeah, numbers don't lie. Um, yeah, that's okay. I'll let it go. Uh, I hate so bad. I just huh? get your hate off. I you know I'm not gonna hate. I'm just going because the. I'm not gonna hate because no matter what billion dollars is billion dollars. Right, but what's what's your what's your counterpoint? I'll say that. What's your counterpoint? Not hate. What's your counterpoint? The there is one. I get it. I was gonna say no. I was gonna say the amount. Of, no, there is one. There, okay. there's, there's, there's one. I was gonna say like because that's that's also I feel like it's also like a thing. To, that's why I don't want to slight her because it's like I'm listening. There's the amount of shows uh-huh. to me, right? Uh-huh. Your Taylor Swift, yours gonna be big. So I say that about a lot of people. Yeah, but the okay. amount of billion dollars is to me is like amazing. But I would expect that from a Taylor Swift with this amount of shows. That's all I would say. Well, how many shows was it? Was it a, a normal amount of shows? Yeah, it's not. It's not a normal amount. Of, a abnormal amount of shows. I have to look that up. Yeah, yeah because yeah. there's someone comparable that has a similar amount of shows. And oh, John. That's right. That's who she beat, right? No. 
Oh, he had, Elton John has more. He still has more. Yeah. yeah okay. But he also had, he also had like more like at least another 20, 20 more shows. I think he had. I would also listen to Elton. I would listen to Elton John show. Yeah, that'd be dope. I, be, I would. I think I would. That would be. A I would show. go to Elton John show. I believe. Yeah. Maybe yeah. on the show. But anyway, Rocket I don't. Man, we're, not, we're not. We're not here to. Uh, no, know, but because yeah. Taylor Swift, Taylor Swift. Yeah, so she, she, she's her. Like let's, Yeah. She is her. The the only reason why I pick. I agree, Keith Lee. I don't know about Gunna. Only reason I pick Gunna is because like, well, you know what? Can we take Gunna off? That's all. I'm gonna take Gunna off, and let's switch him with. I'm gonna switch him with Taylor Swift. I'm gonna take Gunna off only because. There were still people, even when he rapped, Ted, they were like, what would you do? Like, it was like, there was still some caping for him in the sense that, like, what would you do in that situation? Like, no one knows the truth. No one knows if he's really... Yeah, we still don't know anything. Exactly. But people thought that that would affect his career. career. And it hasn't. And not even close. Not this thing. That's why I was like... That's a good... That's usually a good nomination. The rat allegation is kind of like the death nail. The death nail. Some people's coffin, but he was able to beat that. So, yeah. that's why I had more arrest. That, I can see that. That's a, that's, that was a good nomination, though. But I ain't gonna lie, bro. Yeah, I feel like Ice Spice should be a nominee. I feel like she, I feel like she's it because we were we to be fair, we were down on her when that first one. We like, bro, that, I don't think this is gonna work, dog. We literally like again, we we circled the block. We had to. We had to circle the block. We yeah. went. We definitely were not supportive of Ice we were, Spice. I mean, I, no, well, no, 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 no. Like, 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 I was supportive. I actually, no, no, I ain't gonna lie to myself. I definitely was supportive. I just didn't say. I said it wasn't gonna. I didn't think she was gonna go. As far as she did, right? She beat the fifty minutes of fame, a hundred percent. And the reason why I, the only reason why I didn't choose her as a nominee was because it got quiet. This last Q four was quiet for her. That's the only reason why I did not pick. But I don't think that's fair, only because she did so much in the first nine months. Because she had a Taylor and a Nikki. That was for six months. When did Barbie movie come out? Barbie movie was probably the beginning of the third quarter. That, June, that June, right? It had to be. Let me see. Let me look up. Because if that's the or maybe that's the end of the third quarter Barbie. or the second quarter. But that still that was like a top ten chart, right? Top ten record on billboards. Uh, the Barbie record was number two. Yeah, it went yeah. Two. So like, oh, July twenty one, July twenty one. So even that's third quarter. So third quarter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, so the I first see that. for the first nine that. months, like you know, she did a lot of work. Plus, she had the EP. Yeah, or whatever. So, you know, next is next is the album for sure. Like, yeah. that's gonna be the next Telltale sign. Yeah, uh, her performances have gotten better. Better, it has gotten better. You know, so I she, see, she's I definitely see that. better than what she was. She was, she was better than what people said she was gonna be. Right, in the sense that, like, plus, how, you know, that shit, I. That shit, I. That shit, I. That shit, I. My mom's I. Uh, but I think her mom, mom's I too. Her mom's I. Right. <laughs> I would be mad. I, I. I would be mad. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Ice spice, mom spice. Don't care. I don't know. Give me all the seeds. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, but I, let's just give it to Keithley. I feel like Keithley. I'm gonna go Keithley. Keithley is like there's not a bad thing I can say about Keithley. There's no, nothing. There really isn't. And what there's he's doing, nothing for, I can say about that. And what Keithley. he's doing for people's businesses is ridiculous. I know people are upset because now they have to wait in lines, but like still, it's like, hey, listen. At what the end of the day, for he's up business. black and POC businesses. Yes. Uh, and not even like big ones, like yeah. mom and pop shops. Exactly. Like one that's, lady was, that's, the, that's the key. One lady that she was making like maybe, what, 500 a day? She went from 500 a day to now making close to like 10 grand a day. And like now she's to the point where she has to open up another shop. Like so, it, this is her dream. She never thought that would be the case. Again, but, like you're not going to get me to say a bad thing about Keith Lee. A hundred percent. Now, he did 100%. go to New York. How did you feel about that situation? He went to New York, but I think he doesn't have the right people that followed him or got good friends. They gave him bad advice. 100%. No, I know he was like trying to defend himself, but no one's eating a sandwich chopped cheese. Right. I think it's, I got suggested to him, and I can probably guess what they look like. They suggested it. Mm-hmm. They're the new Brooklyners. They, they live in Brooklyn. They're, they're the, uh, they're the new Brooklyn. The, the gentrifiers. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the, the gentrificons. Yeah. The, mm-hmm. the Decepticons. Yeah, they're the mayo made with olive oil. They're, they're, made, they're olive oil mayo. <laughs> God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're like they mind your business. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> mind your business. One hundred percent. One hundred percent. Yeah. Um. But yeah, I, let's let's. I'd say that we give our Large in Life Award this year to mm-hmm. Keith Lee. To Keith Lee. To Keith. I like that. Keith yeah. Lee. Shout out to Keith Lee. Uh,